Good morning, everyone. I'm Eva Gonzalez, and this is Colton High School's very own. We will be providing you with a variety of updates about school, weather, local stories, and even worldwide stories. Please join us for the club and sports segment with Destiny. Hi, Hello Jackets. My name is Destiny Mejia, and I will be bringing this week's club announcements. Cross Club meets Mondays at 3.30 p.m. For questions, email Mrs. Garza. Brown Book Club meets Mondays at 3.30 p.m. For any questions, email Mrs. Leva. Wellness Club meets Tuesdays at 3.30 p.m. For any questions or more info, email Mr. Alvarez. AP Honors and Biology Club meets Thursdays during lunch. For any questions, email Mr. Siebe. And finally, Marine Biology Club meets Thursdays at 2.15 p.m. For any questions, email Mrs. Pelletier. And here's Adia with class announcements. Good morning, Yellow Jackets. My name is Adia Oropesa, and I will be speaking about class events coming up and freshman follow-ups. Some class events that we have coming up is the junior class will be hosting a scavenger hunt on April 30th, and more details will be attached on this flyer. Now, seniors. Seniors will be having an in-person graduation and will be going to Universal Studios for grad night. Seniors will also be having a senior sunrise, an award ceremony, the commitment ceremony, a picnic, and lastly, a senior sunset. And all of these events will be in person. More details to come on senior activities will be sent to your guys' emails, so make sure you're checking them daily. Now, freshman follow-ups. There are only two freshman follow-ups left for the school year, so make sure you guys are using your time wisely with your link crew leaders. And now I'll be handing it off to Ashley with the COVID updates. Hi, Yellow Jackets. My name is Ashley Rodriguez, and I'm here with your COVID updates. The San Bernardino County is now currently in the orange tier, meaning that some indoor businesses will now open with some modifications. As for vaccinations, they are now available to everyone over the age of 16. That is all for COVID updates, and I'll pass it on to Marlene with birthday shoutouts. Hi, I'm Marlene Perez with your birthday shout outs, and we would like to say happy birthday to the following students Emily Martinez, Jacoby High, Eric Rodriguez, Joanna Aguilera Chavez, Leonardo Moya, Mary P., Summer Rodriguez, Andrea Vega, Celine Magana, and Joseph Molina. Happy birthday! for the month of April. Hi, Yellow Jackets. I am here with your weather for Friday, April the 22nd. It is expected today for the highest to be 72 degrees and the lowest 48, along with that falling through the weekend and some slight rain on Monday. Now, I'll pass it on to Mia Rojas with CIF and sport updates. Thank you so much, Ashley, for that weather announcement. Now for a sports announcement, here are the scores from some of the games this last week. For girls tennis, they beat Sanji by a score of 10-8 to get their first win of the season. We also have a big win for the boys soccer team with 8-0 over Rim of the World. Dario Bravo scored two goals and keeper Eric Guzman recorded his second consecutive shutout. The team is now 2-1 this season. In the season opening, the Swim Meet at Arroyo Valley, our CHS girls got the win and our boys performed well in a loss despite being outnumbered. Good effort all the way around. Here are some pictures of the Swim Meet. And now to hand it off to Destiny with Student of the Month Highlight. Thank you, Mia. Hello, Yellow Jackets. My name is Destiny Mejia and I will be bringing this week's Student of the Month. This week's student of the month is Alessandra Stone Street, and here, here she is with a few words. My name is Ali. Um, I got the award for my work experience class, and I feel very happy because it's cool to get recognized. Um, I want to thank my mom for helping me with all my work and keeping me on track, and Miss Brown for the nomination. Thank you, Alessandra, and congrats, and keep up the good work. And next is Juliana with Newsflash. Attention Yellow Jackets, the last day to cast your vote for Mr. and Mrs. Yellow Jacket is Tuesday, April 27th at 3 p.m. Remember the award is for the senior boy and girl who best represents Colton High School. The ballot closes at 3 p.m. and good luck to all the nominees.
Arms and Fire from the Wellness Center. Hope is a group that provides a safe and supportive environment for students experiencing depression and anxiety. It helps with self-care during a pandemic, reducing stigma, building resiliency, and coping strategies. If you're interested in participating in the classroom, the code is XPMZS2G. Thank you, Juliana. Um, for this week's special story, it's going to be the Godlike AP exam drive through uh, CHS students have planned a drive through event to hand out study supplies and goodie bags for all AP exam test takers. Students will go to the staff parking lot by, uh, by 3rd Street on Tuesday, April 27th between 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. to pick up items from the AP teachers. If your AP teacher isn't handing out any study materials, please stop by anyway since we will be giving all AP exam test takers a goodie bag before AP testing begins. Make sure to wear your mask because you will exit the vehicle to pick up items and then get back inside your vehicle once you get the final goodie bag. Okay, this week's staff of the month is going to be a little bit different. Instead, because next week is Teacher Appreciation Week, students can show their appreciation by filling out a virtual staff appreciation card via the Google form sent out to your student emails from Mrs. Buskirk and CHS Renaissance. You can fill out as many virtual cards as, as you want, as long as they are all done by April 23rd at 3 p.m. Next up is Mia with information about senior meeting about a senior meeting and events. Thank you so much, Gilberto, for those announcements. And now information regarding our graduation ceremony. It will now be hosted in person. There was a meeting on April 1st talking about how we will do it in person now. And if you missed that meeting and you want to look over it, there should be the video and the presentation link sent to your email, so you can go ahead and check that. And now for pickup days for materials and food with Andrea. My name is Andrea, and I'll be going over the food and material pickup information. CGUSD will be giving out grab-and-go meals every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. at the schools listed here. The front office will also be open on Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., but they will be closed for lunch from 12 to 1 p.m. Students can drop off or exchange materials at the Rancho Bus Loading Area from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. This has been Colton High School's very own. I'm Eva Gonzalez, and on behalf of our team, we are pleased to provide you with accurate and weekly stories. Take care, Yellow Jackets.